So of course, after Mom Duke saw my video, apartment shopping, and she found out how much that monthly was. If you know when you got Mom Dukes that always held you down all of your life, and moms is still in your life, trust and believe my mother called me up quick and she was like, boy, you're not spending $3,000 a month to stay nowhere, that's not happening. I got a whole room up over here. Until you figure things out, you stay up over here. Oh, wow. Whew. Oh, man. It's crazy, man. Normally when I uh, come to my mother's house, I just like scoop her up, take her out to dinner, take her out to breakfast, sit here in the living room <laughs> like I'm about to do right now. And um, that's about it, man, you know? Just just spend some quality time with Mom Dukes. Ugh. Oh, she got popcorn shit? Hold on a second, y'all. Mom's got some some snick snacks? Mom, what's, what's this? What's this ghetto movie theater butterfly? Brims? Mom, who Brims? Who Brims is? <laughs> Premium popcorn, gluten free. Mom, you be eating just whatever. Hold on. They smell good, though. I ain't got stunt. Try to get up in here. Get like two or three of these drums. Oh! My word! You didn't tell me about these? These are banging. They dumb buttery, too. Gluing free, huh? I mean, I don't care about that. Whatever. You know, you can put the glue and all in my stuff. I don't give a... But, yo. Movie theater. But, all right. So, when I go to the store, and I, it has to be at a store out here. Because where I live, I never see brims. And I don't know if you guys have brims where you live, but hit me in the comment section and let your boy know. Because uh, brims is where it's at. All right. Enough of that, though. I ain't got stuff, man. When you come back... That bag might be straight gone. Like that bag right there. That bag right there might be a wrapperoni. Might be a wrapperoni. Pictures, yo. Mom's in the pictures. You know what I'm saying? Oh, man. Me and the girls. My oldest. Me and wifey. My daughter, Dej. Mom's mom, Lisa. Fam, there's always that I am home feeling you get when you go inside of certain houses. And just to let you guys know, this is, I don't remember how old I was when my mother bought this house. But I remember we were living on McPadden Drive for like maybe the first, how old was I when it got me? Like, I don't know, mom, was I seven, eight when you bought this house? Because we were living on McPadden Drive. That was the first spot we were living in. And I loved it over there. You know, the, just the, the neighborhood, my friends, my peoples, going to Turbo. There's so many stories that I have from McPadden. But I remember moving out there and mom's taking it to the next level of home ownership. And this is the first house that she bought right here. And, uh, wow, man, I mean, oh my goodness. So many stories, y'all, so many stories, you know what I'm saying? Ma, I'm saying I love you. I love you dearly, but as for, oh, shoot, look at, hold on, time out, yo, time out, kid. Mom Duke's got the book, oh. In across America, she got it right up over her little wine cooler over here in the corner. All right, Ma, I see you. I see you, moms, you know what I'm saying? Boom bap, original rap. I'm all up in your kitchen right now, though, you know. I'd have your refrigerator looking different, I can tell you that much. You, you been eating healthy on your boy, huh? Okay, I see you. I see you. Refrigerator just looking organic up in this piece. Mmm. You ain't got nothing really worth eating. Really worth drinking, either, for that matter. What, what is this? Come on. Hold on, time out. How you? <laughs> I, I ain't gonna put moms out there in front street, but why you? Huh? Phone ringing and everything. Who calling? 
You know my mother at work? I'm a G dog. Answer the phone, you know what I'm saying? Come on, man. No, I don't know. Miles, what I saw in the refrigerator, you you living your best life. I see you. I see you. Come been. I was saying it like, did my mother know I'm in the house? They got cameras around here? Was, was that you calling the crazy? Like, my mother's the only person I know that still has a landline. She has a cell phone, but she actually has a landline in the house. I don't even know what the science is. That's like having a VCR. I don't know what I'm going to find. Right, I'm about to take y'all upstairs to my, my old bedroom from back in the days. I moved out of here when I was what? <clears throat> I want to say... 21 because that's when I purchased my first property I bought a condo back then on the East Haven New Haven town line over the Q bridge off exit 50 Forbes Commons but anyway Leo, let's let, let's let's go upstairs real quick you know what I'm saying let's take this conversation upstairs <sighs> oh my goodness all these candles on the steps what are you doing Okay, let's go up my old bedroom over here. Bam. All right, y'all, I'm going to give y'all a quick tour. I can just stand in place and turn. You know, you know what I'm saying? Little quickie, quickie, little quickie, quickie, quick, quick jump. Little quickie, quickie, quick, quick jump. Bong, bong, boom, bap, original rap. All right, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Ah. Ah. It's crazy. That's good, actually. That, that, that works. Oh, man. This room, man. This this room right here. Bring, oh, shoot. Sneakers that I gave to Mom Dukes. You know what I'm saying? She got them up in here. The box joint. I signed these for her? Your own pair to flex on him from your son with love. Damn, could y'all see that? I don't know if y'all can see that. Uh, uh, flex sneakers, y'all. Little flex shoes, baby. Little flex shoes. Oh, oh. Chill, 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 chill. Chill, that's not, that's light, that's light. We all know when you move up out of your parents' house, you never think to yourself, I got to come back here for anything. Things in life happen, especially when you're younger. When you're younger, to move out, to come back, to move out, to come back, it happens, right? When you get older, mm -mm. And me and my mother, we are so much alike that it makes it virtually impossible to live together. And my, I love you. I know, I know you're going to watch this. I, I love you dearly. <laughs> and as easy as it would be for me to come here to save money every single month on my own spot while I'm working on things, to, as easy as that would be. <sighs> Ma, we bump heads, Mom. We, we bump heads. Crazy. And I know, like, I know there's individuals where... You know, they, their parents are old school, right? So you move back in with your parents, you be 30, you could be 40, be 50, they be like, hey, you know, I expect you in at a certain time. Huh? I'm grown. I ain't coming in at all. I pop up when I get here. This right here is a, be a resting stop. That's all it will be, a resting stop. That means I'm resting at 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm coming back 3 o'clock in the morning. Keep the alarm off. I use my key. Boop, boop, boop. Come in, sleep for like two hours to go start my day. You know that that's the kind of grind that I'm on. So, Ma, that's why I wouldn't do that to you. I wouldn't be coming in here all wild hours of the morning, you know, waking you up out of your, your, your beauty slumber. I wouldn't do that to you. I wouldn't put you out of your house, eating up all the food in the fridge. Although, Ma, I ain't going to stop. I do miss your cooking. You used to cook for me. Ma, you ain't cooked for me since... Forever. Ooh. It's been a minute. It's the last home cooked meal that I've had inside this house. 
friends of mine were they were they getting married and my mother wanted to make a big dinner for everybody myself Ramir my peoples that was years ago ma years ago like so long ago I almost forgot it even happened but this room brings back memories. Like I remember my bed being right over here in the corner. And um, my oldest daughter, Dej, you know, she was, she was newborn back then, you know. Just uh, laying on my chest. I had it when I was 19. You know, just laying on my chest. Falling asleep, drooling on me. But that happened here I remember I remember punching a hole in my mother's bedroom wall because um, I was young I was doing dumb things back then um, there was a female that I was going to visit and my mother wasn't having no parts of it because I was in a relationship and moms knew I was about to take this trip. Came in the room, came in this room and said, before you think you're going somewhere tomorrow, I'm just gonna let you know, you're not gonna do so and so wrong by going to see another female. Now, now why I know about it. Huh? Ma, how you stopping my pimping? How you, how you interrupting my hustle, ma? She's like, it ain't happening. She's like, I'll tell so and so myself. Oh, you gonna you gonna snitch on me, yo? You my mama. You ain't her mom's. You you my mama. You gonna tell on me, yo? Mom's is fit to tell on your boy. I got so mad, yo. So I, you know, I waited for her to leave, cause she wasn't fit to kill me and kick me out. I was just mad. I was walking around the house. Just, Ugh. I don't even know why I ended up in her bedroom. She was at work. I don't know why I ended up in her bedroom. I think I probably want to go get something. And I was just, I was thinking about it. She had messed up my trip. And I was like, bow! And when I hit it with the bow, uh, yeah, a whole entire hole just boop, all up in her wall. <clears throat> Young me didn't think to go run to a Home Depot, get no patch, patch that up quick. I left the hole there and ran to my aunt's house. <laughs> So I'm over at my aunt's house. I remember my mom's called up over there. And she was like, uh, have Dame come home. I come home, you know, she furious. What happened to the wall? Like, yeah, you can't even lie to moms at that point. I was like, I was upset. I was upset and punched the wall. And I didn't think it was going to make a hole, but it made a hole. She was like, have it patched up by tomorrow. Or you can get out by tomorrow. Oh, shoot. My mom's a triple OG. So, I don't even know where that was going, y'all. But, just little things like this. Too many, too many stories. Too many memories. A lot of good memories. A lot of, there's, there's, there's some bad. Not, not too many too bad, but, just, I'm good, Ma. Thank you. Thanks. But it's good to, to be able to have a key. To be able to step up in here whenever. You know, if ever I need to step up in here or I need a spot to crash and I'm out this way, I do that. But as far as living with you moms, I love you, but that I can't do. <laughs> Yo, it's your main man, Dame Dropshaw. Thank you. As always, man. As always. You guys have been amazing. You continue to be amazing. Those of you that are scratching your head daily like, damn, why? When are we going back to the food? Why? I, I can't be. I can't get back to that place fully here until I get from this space. I gotta, I, I gotta get right. Y'all know that. I gotta get right, baby. But um, by the time you watch this video, I should be in Florida for a playlist live. I hope you know. I see some of y'all out there. You know, you, you, you'll see me. I'm, I'm pretty tall. Like, just me and T. Pendel, we, we usually the tallest people <laughs> at that playlist live. But, um, hope to see y'all out there. And I hope I can get some positive content while I'm out there. That's, 
that's the plan. Maybe I can, I don't know. I don't know. All right, y'all, but much love, man. I'll see y'all next video, all right? Keep it crispy.